Hi, this is Kim with Six Blessings, and I found some creepiness this weekend. So I've got to share, of course, um, my eBay store, Hager Mom of Six Blessings, is pretty much 98% vintage items, but um, I choose things that are hard goods, mainly um, decorative glass and bases, etc anything interesting or unusual or unique um, in my store. But when I started this venture with my eBay store, um, the very first item I sold was a very creepy doll. Um, her eyes, you know, open and shut. Um, and when you moved her legs back and forth, her head would go. And my 19 year old son made me put her outside because he was too scared to sleep in the house with her. But she did sell for $125. That is my biggest sale to date in the three months that I've been doing this with all of my hard goods and vintage items. So I like to be on the lookout, bowling for dolls. And sometimes I just find ones that are cute, a little creepy, but um, that's kind of my, my statement thing. So here we go. This one looks like a little boy and I don't know who dressed him, but um, he's outgrown it and it's got flowers all over it. He looks very angry. Um, I don't know what his finger gestures are doing. Maybe he's doing the rock and roll. Dude, I'm going to a concert maybe. And then the other one, he looks like he's ready to suck his thumb. So I don't know. He looks a little angry probably because he's wearing a bow and girl's clothes and he just looks too masculine to be a little girl. He's made by Horseman, I believe. Um, he's very vinyl-y and plasticky. Um, very cheaply made, but um, I think he's very old as well. So I'm gonna name him Norman because I don't know, I guess that's just the creepy name from that movie. Um, I don't remember it, but you all do, or you probably don't because you're all probably younger than me and I'm not even that old. So this is Norman. Hey, what's up? Rock on, party on, rock and roll. Now this is one and I won't be selling these because these are just not fabulous enough to sell in my store. Um, she is ceramic and she's in a, it's like a crawling position, but why did they make such a big booty on a baby way back when? Because she's definitely very old. Well, actually not that old. It says 1991. So I guess she is considered vintage, but it looks more like a sixties piece, but she's got a big old tushy. She's cute until you look at her face look closely looks like they heavily mascared and did the eye very nicely on one side and the other side they just kind of forgot they just were done with her I don't even know what to call her Tracy Tracy so those are the two odds and ends creepy cute dolls that I found this weekend and I'm gonna do a video in the next couple days of some of the fabulous finds that I found from my store Hager mom of six blessings on eBay and please I found someone in Goodwill the other day and she actually subscribed to my YouTube channel and I was so excited because that was my second one and I think the other one's my daughter so if you like what you see um, I like to have fun and be funny and kind of quirky and um, I'm very hyper um, then please subscribe and like the videos and just leave any comments and this is six blessings and sorry for all the stuff in the background, but my, um, my youngest of six kids is turning 12 in a couple days, so I've been outside rapping. And I've got lots of birds out here with me, so that's what all that racket is. Y'all have a great week, and I'll see you in a few days. Thanks. Bye-bye.